So I'm here at my friend Bobby Machado's house and the cops are banging on the door, banging on the windows. They have their lights pointed at his windows. And as far as I know, this is a terror tactic, a harassment tactic, trying to force him out of his house, which he probably isn't even in. But the cops seem to think that he's in his house and now are harassing him. And as far as I know, they didn't get a phone call about domestic disturbances or anything else like that. Unless they have a warrant, this is so much harassment. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> sir, can I have your name? No, you cannot. Okay. Um, the reason I'm talking to you is because you said you knew the residents of this apartment. No, uh, well. The subject in there currently has a warrant for his arrest, okay? So I'm asking you if you could provide us with his phone number and we can ask him to come out okay. so he can be placed under arrest so we don't have to further go through with what we're I plead the here. fifth. Okay, so you're refusing to help us out, provide us with his phone number so we can try to get him out here cooperatively and place him under arrest? I don't have his phone number. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. What up, Memphis? Now they're looking through his windows in the back window, shining their lights in the bathroom window. The bathroom window where there's little kids that might go to the bathroom. This is probably the reason why right here that most kids in America are afraid of cops. And I want to call attention to the irony of the whole thing. The cops standing and loitering right next to the no loitering signs. Please take notice. <laughs> Why are you damaging public property? I don't have to shush, it's called freedom of speech. And I just witnessed and put camera on you guys destroying private property. So now they've disabled Bobby's camera right above his window there. He just hit it with some kind of item either a hoe or a rake or something. So he just destroyed private property. And they're blocking the street blocking a public way, not allowing any traffic to go through. And so now this man is gonna have to back up a one-way street and cause an accident, possibly.
This right here is a terror act. They're committing terrorist acts against people in the city of Portland right now. They've got lights facing at his windows. They're banging on his door. They're screaming in his windows. And they just said they were going to force open the door of somebody's house that has small children. Now they're banging on the door again. I do believe you actually have to have a search warrant to bust the door open, otherwise an arrest warrant has to be accompanied by contact of the person for the warrant. If you bust open the door and I witness it, that's breaking and entering. That's breaking and entering. You just broke into somebody's house illegally. You're on video. At this time, you guys are breaking and entering and causing property damage to somebody's personal property. And you have not made contact with the person for the arrest warrant. You do not have a search warrant that I know of. Yeah, they just busted in Bobby's house. They don't even have a search warrant. They have an arrest warrant. Bobby yep. Like right in his apartment. Yeah. Holy They're banging on the door. They just broke in the window over there. They don't even have a freaking search warrant. They have an arrest warrant. And they know it's illegal. Unless they can bring a game warden. No, it's not. They're breaking into somebody's house without a without a search warrant. They're breaking in there? They're breaking into somebody's house without a search warrant. They only have an arrest warrant. They have a warrant. Right now they're busting in his door. They're breaking down the door. I hope you guys have a search warrant. When John gets here, he'll ask for it. You guys are breaking and entering. Oh. I'm a citizen of Portland. I'm asking you to stop breaking and entering. You're destroying personal property. I'm asking you guys to stop as a citizen of Portland. That's also called peeping Tom. When you look through somebody's windows without search warrants. That's an arrestable offense also. <laughs> Have you guys found out that he's actually in there or just assuming? Because if he's not home, you can't serve a search warrant or an arrest warrant when nobody's there. You have not made contact with him yet. Got him on tight. Oh yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, all of them. I was the one yelling from the window. I'm taping everything. They busted in his house to actually serve a warrant. I know he was texting me. Yeah. How much? Hey, give me permission right now on tape to be standing in this parking lot since you live here. I do. Give me permission to be standing here? Yeah. Okay. I live right here. It's all right. I got it all on tape, Bob. No. I don't know if it was Ron or whoever it was, but... I've got this all on video from start to beginning, bro. They busted in his window. They busted in the door. If they didn't have a search warrant, he's going to get off scot free. You cannot break into a house with an arrest warrant. Not a search warrant. You need a search warrant to bust into somebody's house. Go ask him if you want if he wants you to sit with, with his kid. His kid's inside. Yeah. Is he in there? Has he got somebody to sit with his son? Yeah, we'll get to him. Okay. Is he going to sit with his kid? No, no, no. I'm going to go talk to him. Bobby, we'll talk to Marcus. I'll yeah. bring him over, okay? Mr. Please listen, yeah. Marcus is home. Marcus is home. Everyone's here. Marcus. 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 Steve, Jess, or what's Steve and Jess there? Steve was supposed to be coming to get him. But if he can go to Janelle's for the night, then we can, then we, you know, if he can go in there and she can get him to school. I mean, I don't even know what's going to happen to me. Pam should be home tomorrow. My phone's right there, Dave. Can you take it? Where is it? Marcus. Hey, buddy. Come over here for a while, okay? We're going to take care of your dad. Don't worry about it. Marcus, do you have a number for your mom, buddy? Um, he's in he's in my custody. Bobby just asked me to take care of him, so I'll take care if of him. If I can confirm that with the other officer, that's fine. It's on my video right now. Come on, Marcus. Bring him inside, okay? Go inside with him. Hang on one second. Mark, yep, I just want to make sure Dad confirms he can, he, he can go with okay. you, okay? Marianne, okay. He comes and plays with me. All right. Mike. Did you guys have a search Dennis. warrant or an arrest warrant? An arrest warrant. So you didn't have a search warrant? We did not. We're not required to have one if the arrest warrant is for his current address. But you guys didn't make is. contact with him before you broke into his house? Yes, okay. You guys are all set. Officer saw him run into the residence. We knew he was in there. I was here from the very beginning. I have it all on video. No, Be careful what you say. That was not from the very beginning. Okay. We made announcements. He did not come out. Now he's under arrest. Yep. And I'm going to take some video of the broken in window right here. There was a fan in the window and it was busted out. And as soon as the police clear out, I'll take pictures of the door that they damaged without a search warrant. And that police officer just said that they did not have a search warrant. Also, they broke his camera. Excuse me, sir. Oh, I'm Thank sorry. You. Don't touch me, please. That's assault. Sir, back up, okay? Thank you. That's the sledgehammer they used to break in the door. There's the doorway of which they broke into without a search warrant. They did not have contact with Bobby Machado before they broke into the house, which is clearly shown on my videotape.
and they're still blocking traffic. Traffic is still backed up in the street. They're causing a, a scene. Marcus is in there. I got it all on tape, Bobby. And they even admitted they didn't have a search warrant before they broke in your house. You need, you need to call anybody? You need to call anybody? Okay, what can I do? Anything? What? Hello? 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 Yeah, I know. I was here the whole time, dude. Fucking videotaped it all. They didn't have a warrant. They didn't have a search warrant. I asked to see a warrant when they come in, and they when they left it in, they wouldn't show me a warrant. They said that they saw Bobby go in, but like I've been here since before they got here, and they did not see Bobby go in at all. I can prove it. I can prove it. He's safe in there. They are going to jail because they broke and entered without a search warrant. I can't wait to show this to Bobby's lawyer. He's going to have a field day with this. But it's all right for the officers to touch us. No. Hang on, he's going to let you tell me. He's going to roll the window down. Okay. Okay, but he he said it's not good for him to go out tonight because the Ron's being an asshole. What? He said it's not good to have Marcus out there tonight. Well, Ron is doing an attitude. That's why. I Bobby, I get the whole thing on videotape. I'll give it to you, the lawyer. This is for a fucking misdemeanor, fucking operating after suspension. Really? Dude, they admitted on tape they didn't have a Please search warrant. He's so stressed as his mother goes to jail tomorrow. I don't know how long Pam should, Pam. Dave's got my phone. I Call got it. Pam. You need to. Will they let you in my house? What are they doing in my house? They're not doing anything. I'll say. Go. I need in Marcus's room. You know where the where the TV's at? The window by the TV. Yeah. Right underneath it, where the ele electrical outlet is, is my phone charger. Okay. Grab it for Dave. He's got to get it. Okay. And I'll get him tonight. Or whoever comes from, that's fine. They stay over here for now, and he can stand. I cannot out. fucking believe that they smash these doors in for fucking a misdemeanor operating after suspension. They said they saw you before, they, and that's why they had the arrest warrant, and they didn't need a search warrant. But I was here from the very beginning. They didn't see you. They pulled up, and they started kicking in doors. Yes, he does. And he's got to be there. He's going to be so stressed out. Dude, I'm going to court with you. We're getting this thrown out. Easily. Easily. Just calm down. Go to, go to jail. Get bailed out. Pam's, um... Uh, Dave's got Pam's number. You got Pam's number? I don't. I got Pam's number. My dad does. Okay, okay. It's in my phone. Dave's got it. Call her. Let Why are you harassing other people now? They won't let me in until the dining room. I just have to go in the guy. What are they doing in my house? I don't know. I said, let me go in. I'm getting this thing. They're going in the house. Search me. What? Did they not have a search warrant? Because I could have sworn a cop said they didn't have a search warrant. Why are they all in the house? No search warrant, but you guys are still in the house searching the house? Why? Not searching the house. Why are you on his property? He's arrested. He's under arrest. We're waiting to take photos. Why photos? Because we're going to take photos of the damage to the door. That's what we do. You guys did damage to the door doing what? Breaking into his house? Breaking into the house without a search warrant, right? You don't need a search warrant. You need an arrest warrant. You did not have contact with Bobby Machado. Yes, no, you did yes, not. I was here from the very beginning, bro. We it's all on tape. Yeah. It's all on tape. Yeah. All right. Not only is it all on tape, but it's on security camera. Two other people taped the whole situation. It does matter. He's going to get off scot-free because you guys messed up. Admit it. You're not a lawyer. You don't even have Excuse you? Training. Excuse you? How do you know what I do? You don't know what I do, do you? That's assuming something, right? Isn't that called profiling, which is illegal? Yes, it is. Yes, he is. He gave... Bobby has permission. He gave Bobby permission. Bobby gave him permission. It has nothing to do with you. Do you? Yes, I do. Okay, and why? Nobody's going inside right now. Why not? take a picture, and we're leaving. There you go. And then you can ask him to Okay, go ahead. Do your thing. Do you understand that? Totally understand. Shane, I got it all on tape. It's all good. Shame. Yeah. That's all right, though. Bobby's lawyer is going to have a field day with this video. He's going to be like, really? Oh, you can go in and speak to Marcus. Yeah, yeah, go in. Yeah.
It's Dimitri, it's not cassette. So the police officers are in the apartment right now, which is illegal. That's not where they're supposed to be. They said they're only taking pictures of the door. Why do they need to be inside the apartment to take pictures of the door? And they're still inside. And they're still inside. So what you can't see right now is there's actually two officers standing in the hallway. One of them's actually inside the apartment. And they've actually said on the video that they don't have a search warrant, so they have no reason to be inside the apartment at all. I can't wait to show this to Bobby's lawyer. Do you know how to answer this thing when it rings, dude? Because he said he's going to call me. And It'll just pop up now and say answer. Up, first. Okay. Yeah, because it was buzzing, buzzing. I think there was a message. Jessica said Steve was like five minutes away. Jessica Rice. Yeah. Well, that's you, Steve, right? No, I'm not Steve. I'm Shane. Shane, I get confused. I'm sorry, man. And they're still searching the apartment. Yeah, I know. That's what I said. Why, Why are they still searching the apartment, I wonder? Because they don't have a search warrant. They're not supposed to be inside the apartment. I know they're not taking any pictures. It's just an excuse to look inside his apartment. And you can see off the reflection of the door, the officer leaving the apartment again. Again, off the reflection of the door, you can see the officer entering and leaving the apartment again.
Is it still in there? Yeah, the cops are still in there. They've already arrested Bobby, and yeah, now they're Marcus. illegally searching the, the house. Yeah. Marcus is safe. He's over at Elizabeth's house. He's where? Right. Over here. Yeah. And so now the officer is outside the apartment because he knows I'm videotaping him. I got it all on video, dude, from the very beginning to the very end. They have an arrest warrant, not a search warrant, and they busted down his door to serve an arrest warrant. Warrant. That's illegal. Excuse me, officer, can we gain entry to Bobby's house, please? Landlord's coming down to secure the door. Actually, his kid would like to come inside, and we have permission to go inside, and we have a key to enter that door that's busted down now illegally, but we do have permission to enter that residence. So I can get his I have a key. And we'd like to have or gain... Pro to come in and get whatever he needs. We'd like to gain entry to that apartment without the police superseding. Is that okay? Uh, yeah. As I said, the sun's all set to come in and get whatever Thank he needs. Thank you. The summit lives here. Thank you. <laughs> Marcus, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with you, okay? okay. All right. Lock on the door. Door is smashed in. Repeated damage to the outside of the door. Go ahead, Marcus. And this was all on an arrest warrant, not a search warrant, which they did not have contact with Bobby before they busted in the house. They also broke in a window over here. Caused all this damage. There's coffee pot broken. They caused multiple things to break. with the window broken. Marcus, were you scared when they broke in the house? Yes. How scared were you? Uh, so scared that I were you fearing for your life? Yes. Oh, come here. I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to shut the door. No, you're not gonna shut the door completely. I'm sorry, but you're not gonna let his cat outside either. Okay, grab his cat. No, I'm not grabbing his cat. His cat belongs here, lives here. You guys have control of Bobby, right? So the search warrant ends. The arrest warrant ends. Uh, a little bit right now. All right. All right, thanks. The officer is putting his foot in front of the door so I cannot stop the cat from going out. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Come here, kid. Come here, kid. Shit.
Will you grab him? And the officer has his foot in front of the door again. Please move your foot, please, from the door. Okay. I'm asking I'm you nicely. For the landlord to come and secure this door. Okay. His son, the resident of this apartment, is already here. And there are also other people outside, including uh, you, myself. Can you go grab the cat for this guy? He grabbed the cat for you. 